hello students good morning in your previous period we learn uh, how to insert an image in your html or a web page now today we are going to start with a new topic that is known as your listing okay today we are going to start with a new topic which is known as your listing and listing can be divided into two that is your ordered list and unordered order list okay listing can be divided into two parts that is your order list and unordered list this is your today's topic or uh, order list means that is your number the 1 2 3 this is your order list that means i hope you all have seen such kind of examples that is your in this way have you seen this in suppose if you are uh, going to any website this will be your thing that means a list can be seen with the numbers the series numbers 1 2 3 4 okay the, this is your order list or it can be in your uh, Roman, Roman numbers one, comma, two, comma, three. In this way, or it can be in a capital Romans also. There's a one, comma, two, comma, three. This is your ordered list. The ordered list means it it will be in a order. That is a either one, two, three, or uh, Roman num uh, letters will be there. Or A B C D is also there. That is your. So uh, capital A B B C or small A B C D. So this was your this was your list of your ordered list. Now unordered list. Unordered list means your bullets. The first example is your bullet. That means square see this is the best example of your unordered list that means can you see this uh, no, in left side of this chocolate a small dot is there this is your first example of your unordered list second example is your circle this is a third example that is your square okay this are your examples of your unordered list listing can be divided into two first one is your order list second is your unordered list now we'll be starting with a notepad first of all what i have done h1 unordered list that means this will be my output that means i want an unordered list heading should be there which will be in a capital letters okay that's why i am using h1 or else i can use head tag also but it a normal font will be there but i want this to be in a capital one now next topic next is that ul type ul means unordered list on uh, un ul stands for unordered list see ul stands for unordered list uh, over here i've started ul ul means an order list on uh, ul tag has been started ul tag has been closed now for for certain period time i'm going to leave this okay an order list started an order tag closed now listing has been started li chocolate over over here uh, i'm going to write types of chocolates and i yes chocolate types of ice creams 
heading is given as H1 and on order list what I have done chocolate vanilla has been given control plus save now I am going to run it over here and you can see types of chocolate has been uh, types of ice creams and the font size you can see chocolate and vanilla is been there okay now this is as I told you this is your best example of your which list that is your unordered list which will be in a bullet suppose if I want this to be in a uh, some big font so what I will be doing I will be using over here font size equal to 6 6 control save can you see now font size has been increased not only 6 I can use five, 4 Chalo. now you can see size has been increased 5 understood in this way you can change your size also okay that means now if I want over here you can see it is in a bullet shape now if I want this to be in a square you will type equal to circle okay so what happens automatically these things will be in a circle that means instead of bullets now you can see it is in a circle now instead of circle I can use the okay leave it as circle only now if I want to create an another another list what I will be doing I will be using the h1 now heading types of shoes h1 close now you can see the output over here another you can see okay now in case if I want uh, Nike Adidas. Puma okay now you can see the output can you see the output that means types of shoes has been given heading now Nike Adidas Puma and Banda that means by default always remember it will be in a which type of it will be now you can see by default it will be in a bullets okay if we want to specify it okay then only we have to write U L type is equal to circle. Now, if I'm writing over here, U L type type equal to square. Okay. Now you can see the output it has been square okay over here I have used the type as circle and here I have used it as square so it is showing over here as a square so this are your best example of your which type of list that is your unordered list okay that means we can use by default always remember it will be in bullets only if you want to change it then only we have to use the ul type is equal to square ul type is equal to circle if you want to say uh, change the font size you can change it over here but over at the starting i have started the tag but i have not not closed the tag that's why the whole content it is it is in a five size okay now if i'm closing it over here font tag now you can see font tag has been closed now rest of the things the size will be small sorry huh. you can see the small size compared to this thing the size of this thing is the small one and now why you now you will be asking why the size of this and this are same because I have used the uh, tag as h1 you can see h1 h1 okay and always remember h1 is a 
is used for increasing the font of the head in font size now next is your ordered list okay this was your unordered list now next is your ordered list for order list i'm going to write it as h1 h1 sorry i have to close this tag H1 will be uh, types of mobiles, mobile brands. H1. Okay, now you can see the output as types of mobile brands. Okay, now I'm going to show the example of your ordered list. That is your OL. OL has been started. OL has been closed. Okay. Now, whatever you are going to write between, that is your Vivo, Oppo. Can you see types of mobile brands vivo and oppo that means you can see now we are not able to see this uh, uh, square circle or bullets now we are getting the numbers that means i uh, automatically numbers are there over here that means again if i'm going to write here as oh God. nokia Can you see Vivo, Oppo, Nokia, Motorola? Okay. Now OL. If I want this to be in a OL type equal to A. OL start. Okay, sorry. what I have run OL type is equal to A that means by default it will be if I'm not mentioning it it will be in a 1 2 3 4 now if I'm starting I'm writing over here OL type is equal to small a so automatically now you can see a small a b c d is the now if I'm writing capital A capital A control save now you can see it's capital A b c d now if I want this to be in a Roman numbers see first one started now you can see one two three four can you see over here now if i want this to be in a capital roman letters capital roman letters okay these are your today's this was your today's topic that is your types of listing two types of listing we learned that is your order list and second one is your unordered list okay and best example of your ordered list is your one two three and uh, okay, roman letters one two three or abc and unordered list the best example is your that is your bonus square square circle or bullet by default in unordered list it will be in a bullet and by default in your order list it will be now one two three four i hope you all got today's topic thank you students